severe thunderstorm watch information. The National Weather Service has issued severe thunderstorm watch number 508, effective until 8 p.m. This watch includes the following counties in Nebraska, Adams, Buffalo, Clay, Fillmore, Hall, Hamilton, Howard, Merrick, Nance, Polk, Sherman, and York. This watch includes the following counties in Nebraska, Frontier, Hayes, Lincoln, and Logan. Remember, a severe thunderstorm watch means the conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including large hail and damaging winds in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets, or Internet sources for the latest severe weather information. Service in North Platte has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Logan County in west central Nebraska, northwestern Custer County in central Nebraska, until 1.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 12.37 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 11 miles north of Stapleton, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include half-dollar size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. Impact, damage to vehicles is expected. Locations impacted include Brown Lake and Shanklin Bluff. This includes Highway 83 between mile markers 117 and 129. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 1.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Logan, Nebraska. p.m. A severe thunderstorm was located near Lexington, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail. Severe weather has been confirmed by train spotters. The following impacts are expected. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. This severe thunderstorm will be near Lexington around 12.55 p.m. Overton around 1.10 p.m. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 229 and 259. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 1.30 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Buffalo and Dawson. Thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Central Phelps County, Northeastern Gosport County, Southeastern Dawson County until 2 p.m. At 1.08 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Smithfield, or 8 miles south of Lexington, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail. Severe weather has been reported by the public. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Locations impacted include, Holdridge. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 236 and 253. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 2 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Dawson, Gosper, and Phelps. Tornado warning information. 
The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for northwestern Phelps County, northeastern Gosper County, south central Dawson County until 1.30 p.m. At 1.12 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located seven miles northeast of Smithfield or nine miles southeast of Lexington, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This tornadic thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of northwestern Phelps, northeastern Gosper, and south-central Dawson counties. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 241 and 248. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 1.30 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Dawson, Gosper, and Phelps. information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for northwestern Phelps County until 1.45 p.m. At 1.20 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located 8 miles south of Overton or 14 miles northwest of Holdridge, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and golf ball size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This tornadic thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of northwestern Phelps County. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 1.45 p.m. for the following county, Phelps, Nebraska. National Weather Service in North Platte has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Custer County in central Nebraska until 2 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 1.34 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located over Callaway or 15 miles southwest of Broken Bow, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Callaway, Lodi, Presley State Wildlife Management Area, and Milldale. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 2 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Custer, Nebraska. A flash flood warning has been issued for Craven County, Jones County, and Pamlico County, effective until 6.09 p.m.
severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Phelps County, western Kearney County, southwestern Buffalo County, until 2.30 p.m. At 1.47 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Elm Creek, or 13 miles north of Holdridge, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail. Severe weather has been confirmed by emergency management. The following impacts are expected. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of northeastern Phelps, western Kearney and southwestern Buffalo counties. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 255 and 276. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 2.30 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Buffalo, Kearney, and Phelps. Service in Aberdeen has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Central Fall County in North Central South Dakota until 2.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 1.52 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located over Burkemere, or 10 miles west of Falkton, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Berkmere around 1.55 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Falkton around 2 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations in the path of the severe thunderstorm include Evergreen Colony. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 2.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Falk, South Dakota. Weather Service in North Platte has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Custer County in central Nebraska until 2.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 1.56 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 9 miles south of Broken Bow, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Broken Bow, Antley, Mason City, Oconto, Berwyn, Westerville, Baroque, Gavin Siding, Lodi, intersection of Highway 183 and Cumber Road, Buckeye, Block Hill Basin, Pressy State Wildlife Management Area, and Cumro. This includes the following highways. Highway 183 between mile markers 73 and 100. Highway 2 between mile markers 273 and 307. Highway 92 between mile markers 300 and 308. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 2.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Custer, Nebraska. Laboratory in Upton, New York. Station KWO35 broadcasts on a frequency of 162.55 MHz. Heat advisory remains in effect until 8 p.m. this evening. What? Heat index values up to 103. 
Ware, Eastern Bergen, Eastern Essex, Eastern Passaic, Eastern Union, Hudson, Western Bergen, Western Essex, and Western Union Counties. When, until 8 p.m. this evening. Service in Mount Holly, New Jersey has issued a special marine warning for coastal waters from Sandy Hook to Little Egg Inlet, New Jersey, out 20 nautical miles, until 4 p.m. At 2.58 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing water spouts was located over Axel Carlson Reef, moving east at 15 knots. Hazard, water spouts and wind gusts 34 knots or greater. Source, radar. Impact, water spouts can easily overturn boats and create locally hazardous seas. Small craft could be damaged in briefly higher winds and suddenly higher waves. Locations impacted include, Seagort Reef, Shark River Reef, Point Pleasant Beach, Manasquan Inlet, Axel Carlson Reef, Silverton, and La Valette. Frequent lightning is occurring with this storm. If caught on the open water, stay below deck if possible and keep away from ungrounded metal objects. Test, only a test, of the emergency alert system, from the Island County Department of Emergency Management. In the event of an actual emergency, this system would bring you important information. This is a test, only a test, of the emergency alert system, from the Island County Department of Emergency Management. In the event of an actual emergency, this system would bring you important information. Thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Phelps County, northeastern Gosford County, southeastern Dawson County until 2.45 p.m. At 2 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Johnson Lake or near Lexington, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include quarter-size hail. Severe weather has been reported by the public. The following impacts are expected, damage to vehicles is expected. This severe thunderstorm will be near, Lexington around 2.05 p.m. Overton around 2.20 p.m. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 233 and 250. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 2.45 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Dawson, Gosper, and Phelps. Ten miles southeast of Atwood, moving northeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of southeastern Rollins and southwestern Decatur counties. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 2.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Kansas, Decatur, and Rollins. Service in Goodland has issued a tornado warning for southeastern Rawlins County in northwestern Kansas until 2.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. 
At 2.11 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a confirmed tornado was located 7 miles southeast of Ludell, or 9 miles east of Atwood, moving northeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards included a damaging tornado. A tornado has been reported by the public. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This tornadic thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of southeastern Rollins County. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 2.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Rollins, Kansas. Tornado warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for East Central Phelps County, Northwestern Kearney County, until 2.30 p.m. At 2.10 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located 7 miles north of Funk, or 11 miles southwest of Kearney, moving east at 15 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and golf ball size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This tornadic thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of East Central Phelps and Northwestern Kearney counties. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 2.30 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Kearney and Phelps. County until 4 p.m. At 3.12 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Central Square, or 16 miles west of Camden, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Central Square, Hastings, Constantia, West Monroe, Williamstown, Cleveland, Parish, Amboy Center, Mallory, and Gayville. This includes Interstate 81 between exits 32 and 33. Positive, encouraging K Love. The following is a test of the emergency alert system. This has been a test of the emergency alert system designed to keep you informed in the event of a national, state, or local emergency. Positive, encouraging, K-Love. Thunderstorm was located near Wealth Lake, or 14 miles northwest of Curtis, moving east at 15 miles per hour. Expected hazards include ping-pong ball-size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. Impact, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Wellfleet and Hanson Memorial Reserve State Wildlife Management Area. This includes Highway 83 between mile markers 54 and 68. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. 
repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 3 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Lincoln, Nebraska. Aberdeen has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for North Central Ham County in Central South Dakota, Southeastern Falk County in North Central South Dakota, until 3.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 2.23 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Falkton, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Orient and Miranda around 2.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 3.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in South Dakota, Falk and Hand. Thunderstorm was located near Minden, or 11 miles south of Kearney, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Minden around 2.35 p.m. Other locations in the path of the severe thunderstorm include Norman. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 03.15 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Adams and Kearney. Severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Buffalo County, northeastern Dawson County, until 3.15 p.m. At 2.31 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Sumner, or 18 miles northeast of Lexington, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Miller around 2.35 p.m. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 03.15 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Buffalo and Dawson. Damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Colby around 2.35 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations in the path of this severe thunderstorm include Menlo. This includes Interstate 70 in Kansas between mile markers 44 and 73. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 3.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Thomas, Kansas. Weather Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for northwestern Phelps County, eastern Gosford County, until 3 p.m. At 2.37 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located 7 miles north of Birchland, or 12 miles southeast of Lexington, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and golf ball size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. 
The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This tornadic thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of northwestern Phelps and eastern Gosford counties. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 3 p.m. for the following counties, in Nebraska, Gosper and Phelps. thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Phelps County, northeastern Gosper County, southwestern Buffalo County, southeastern Dawson County, until 3.30 p.m. At 2.39 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from six miles southwest of Overton to near Smithfield, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Bertrand, Overton, and Smithfield around 2.45 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Elm Creek. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 240 and 261. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 3.30 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Buffalo, Dawson, Gosper, and Phelps. Weather Service in North Platte has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Southern Custer County in Central Nebraska until 3.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 2.41 p.m. Central Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Callaway to near Oconto, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Callaway, Ansley, Mason City, Oconto, Buckeye, Block Hill Basin, Presley State Wildlife Management Area, Baroque, Gavin Siding, Lodi, intersection of Highway 183 and Conroe Road, and Conroe. This includes the following highways, Highway 183 between mile markers 73 and 91, Highway 2 between mile markers 294 and 307, Highway 92 between mile markers 300 and 308. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 3.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Custer, Nebraska.
Service in Aberdeen has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Hand County in central South Dakota, southeastern Falk County in north central South Dakota, southwestern Spink County in northeastern South Dakota, until 3.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.03 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located over Rockham, or 14 miles west of Redfield, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near, Zell around 3.10 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Redfield around 3.20 p.m. Central Daylight Time. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 3.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in South Dakota, Falk, Hand and Spink. Severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Adams County, northeastern Kearney County, until 4 p.m. At 3.10 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Hartwell, or 17 miles southeast of Kearney, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half-dollar size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near, Kennesaw around 3.20 p.m. Other locations in the path of the severe thunderstorm include Mietta. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 4 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Adams and Kearney. Expected hazards. National Weather Service in North Platte has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Frontier County in southwestern Nebraska until 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.10 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Stocksville, or 9 miles east of Curtis, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball-size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. Impact, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Eustis, Moorfield, Stockville, Madison Creek Reservoir State Recreation Area, Orofino, Freedom, and Dancing Leaf Earth Lodge. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Frontier, Nebraska. Service in Goodland has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Thomas County in northwestern Kansas, northeastern Logan County, southwestern Sheridan County in northwestern Kansas, northwestern Gove County, until 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.12 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 5 miles north of Oakley, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include ping pong ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. 
this if your thunderstorm will be near, Grinnell around 3.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. This includes Interstate 70 in Kansas between mile marker 67 and 92. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Kansas, Gove, Logan, Sheridan, and Thomas. If you don't leave now, you may be trapped, injured, or killed. Check local media or the Chelan County Emergency Management website in Facebook. Chelan County Sheriff Wildfire Warning Squeal Shock, Mission Ridge, Beehive, Squeal Shock Road south of Wolf CHTS, Halverson Canyon, Hampton Road, Forest Ridge Road and Side Streets, all of Mission Ridge Road, Liberty Beehive Road, Mission Ridge Resort, and Squeal Shock State Park, Level 3 Evacuation Order. Evacuation routes can get blocked. If you don't leave now, you may be trapped, injured, or killed. Check local media or the Chelan County Emergency Management website and Facebook. You will be kept advised as conditions change. Please monitor local radio stations and Chelan County Emergency Management Facebook for updates. Morning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Phelps County, Western Kearney County, East Central Gosford County, Southwestern Buffalo County, until 4 p.m. At 3.19 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 9 miles south of Elm Creek to near Bertrand to Smithfield, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball-sized hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Bertrand and Loomis around 3.25 p.m. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 255 and 275. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 4 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Buffalo, Gosper, Kearney, and Phelps. thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Gosford County, northwestern Furnace County, until 4, 15 p.m. At 3.31 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 9 miles southwest of Eustis to near Medicine Creek Reservoir State Recreation Area to 7 miles north of Bartley, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Cambridge around 3.45 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Holbrook and Tarapaho. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 04, 15 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Furnace and Gosper. Service in Aberdeen has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for East Central Han County in Central South Dakota, Southwestern Spink County in Northeastern South Dakota, until 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.33 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Bedette, or 9 miles northeast of Miller, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Hazard, quarter-size hail. 
Source, Emergency Management. Impact, damage to vehicles is expected. This severe thunderstorm will be near, but at around 3.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in South Dakota, Hand and Speak. Thunderstorm warning for Northern Gove County until 4.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.38 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 6 miles southeast of Grinnell, moving southeast at 40 miles per hour. Expected hazards in 70 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. Severe weather has been reported by the public. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Wind damage is also likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. This severe thunderstorm will be near, go over around 3.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. This includes Interstate 70 in Kansas between mile markers 86 and 112. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 4.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Go, Kansas. Severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Northwestern Adams County, Southern Hall County, until 4, 15 p.m. At 3.40 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Prosser, or 11 miles northwest of Hastings, moving northeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include ping-pong ball-size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near, Donovan around 3.50 p.m. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 293 and 317. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 04, 15 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Adams and Hall. Weather Service in Aberdeen has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Southern Spink County in northeastern South Dakota until 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.42 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Redfield, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Frankfurt around 3.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Glendale Colony around 3.50 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations in the path of the severe thunderstorm include Dolland and Hillside Colony. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Spink, South Dakota. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Hartwell and Norman around 3.55 p.m. Kennesaw and Holstein around 4.05 p.m. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 04, 15 p.m. 
for the following counties in Nebraska, Adams and Kearney. Monroe, or near Mineral Springs, moving northeast at 15 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and penny size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, expects damage to trees and power lines. Locations impacted include Monroe, Weddington, Wesley Chapel, Wingate, Wagsaw, Mineral Springs, Jars, Trinity, Indian Trail, and Marvin. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Please report damaging winds, hail, or flooding to the National Weather Service by calling toll-free 1-800-267-8101 or by posting on our Facebook page or tweet at using hashtag NWSGSP. Your message should describe the event and the specific location where it occurred. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.30 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time for the following county, Union, North Carolina. Tornado warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for Western Adams County, Southeastern Kearney County, until 4.15 p.m. At 3.53 p.m., a confirmed tornado was located near Minden, or 16 miles southeast of Kearney, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Expected hazards included a damaging tornado. A tornado has been confirmed by train spotters. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. The tornado will be near Norman around 4 p.m. To repeat, a tornado is on the ground. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 04, 15 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Adams and Kearney. Mains in effect and a hurricane watch has been upgraded to a hurricane warning for the following locations in Texas. Coastal Clayburg and Clayburg Islands. A storm surge watch has been upgraded to a storm surge warning and a hurricane watch has been upgraded to a hurricane warning for the following locations in Texas. Aransas Islands, Aransas, Calhoun Islands, Calhoun, Coastal Calhoun, Coastal New Aces, Coastal Ruffario, Coastal San Patricio and New Aces Islands. Hurricane warning in effect. What? Southeast winds 40 to 60 knots with gusts up to 85 knots and seas 25 to 30 feet. Where? All the bays and waterways as well we the Gulf waters from Baton Bay to Port O'Connor out to 60 nautical miles. When? Tropical storm force winds possible from Sunday morning until Monday afternoon. Hurricane force winds possible from Sunday evening until Monday morning. Impacts. Extremely strong winds will cause hazardous seas which will likely capsize or damage vessels and severely reduce visibility. Additional details, mariners should remain in port, alter course, and slash or secure the vessel for extreme conditions. A tropical storm watch has been upgraded to a hurricane warning for the following locations in Texas, Rafael and Victoria. Storm surge watch has been upgraded to a storm surge warning and a tropical storm warning is in effect for the following locations in Texas, New Asus and San Patricio.
the National Weather Service in Columbia has issued a flash flood warning for Columbia County in East Central Georgia, East Central McDuffie County in East Central Georgia, Northwestern Richmond County in East Central Georgia, until 8 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 4.58 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Between 1 and 2 inches of rain have fallen. The expected rainfall rate is 1.5 to 2.5 inches in one hour. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. The following hazards are expected. Flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. The following impacts are expected. Flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Grovetown, Evans, Fort Eisenhower, Martin S., Harlem, Riverwood, Appling, Village Plaza Shopping Center, Augusta Mall, Danielfield, Augusta National Golf Club, Somerville, Patriots Park, Columbia County Exhibition Center, Liberty Park Community Center, Blanchard Park, Bellevue Memorial Gardens, Blanchard Woods Park, Westmont and Woodbridge. This includes the following highways. Interstate 20 in Georgia between mile markers 178 and 200. Interstate 520 in Georgia between mile markers 1 and 4. Washington County and Central Vermont until 6 p.m. At 5.02 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Bread Loaf, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and penny-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, expects damage to trees and power lines. Locations impacted include Middlebury, Braintree Hill, Tunbridge, Hancock, Washington, Ripon, Chelsea, Randolph, Rochester, Roxbury, Braintree, Granville, Brookfield, Bethel, Salisbury, Goshen, Luster, Williamstown, Stratford, and Royalton. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Northern Franklin County, Northwestern Webster County, Adams County, Kearney County, until 5 p.m. At 4.14 p.m., 
Severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Hartwell to 6 miles north of Upland to near Hildreth, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Hildreth, Upland, Hartwell, and Norman around 4.20 p.m. Kennesaw around 4.25 p.m. Holstein around 4.30 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Roseland and Mietta. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Adams, Franklin, Kearney, and Webster. Tornado warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for northeastern Adams County until 4.30 p.m. At 4.11 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Hastings, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and half-dollar size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near Hastings around 4, 15 p.m. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 4.30 p.m. for the following county, Adams, Nebraska. a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Newberry County in central South Carolina until 6 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 5.13 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 8 miles south of Joanna, or 11 miles west of Newberry, moving northeast at 5 miles per hour. The following hazards are expected, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and nickel-size hail. Source, radar indicated. The following impacts are expected, expect damage to trees and power lines. Locations impacted include, Dewberry, Dewberry County Airport, Dewberry County Detention Center, Belfast Wildlife Management Area, and Bush River Fire Station. Severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Clay County, northeastern Adams County, southwestern Hamilton County, southeastern Hall County, until 5 p.m. At 4.20 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Hanson, or 9 miles north of Hastings, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. 
Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Donovan and Hanson around 4.25 p.m. Trumbull around 4.30 p.m. Giltner around 4.40 p.m. This includes Interstate 80 between mile markers 315 and 333. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Adams, Clay, Hall, and Hamilton. a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Logan County, southwestern Gove County, until 5.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 4.24 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 8 miles southeast of Russell Springs, Oregon, 13 miles northwest of Scott State Lake, moving southeast at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of southeastern Logan and southwestern Gove counties, including the following locations, the Monument Rocks. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Kansas, Dove and Logan. Dust and quarter-sized hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Raymond around 4.35 p.m. Other locations in the path of this severe thunderstorm include Locris Colony. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.15 p.m. for the following counties in South Dakota, Spink and Clark. Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for northwestern Clay County, northeastern Adams County, until 5 p.m. At 4.29 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Hastings, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and half-dollar size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near Inland around 4.35 p.m. Glenville around 4.40 p.m. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 5 p.m. for the following counties, in Nebraska, Adams and Clay. Service in Goodland has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Dove County until 5.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 4.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 13 miles northeast of Scott State Lake, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. 
Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts sent ping pong ball size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect considerable tree damage. Wind damage is also likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of Gove County, including the following locations, the Monument Rocks. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Gove, Kansas. Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Webster County in central Iowa, southwestern Wright County in north central Iowa, eastern Humboldt County in north central Iowa, until 5.30 p.m. At 4.42 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Thor, or five miles east of Dakota City, moving southeast at 15 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Clarion, Dakota City, Humboldt, Eagle Grove, Goldfield, Thor, Wolstock, Hardy, Eagle Grove Municipal Airport, Sportsman Park, and Clarion Municipal Airport. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.30 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Humboldt, Webster, and Wright. Severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Clay County, northwestern Knuckles County, northeastern Webster County, southeastern Adams County, until 5, 15 p.m. At 4.43 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near air to Cowles, moving east at 45 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half-dollar size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Rosemont around 4.50 p.m. Lawrence around 4.55 p.m. Dowie's around 5 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Fairfield, for your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with these storms, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 05, 15 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Adams, Clay, Knuckles, and Webster. Severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northern Clay County, northeastern Adams County, until 5.30 p.m. At 4.48 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Hastings, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Glenville and inland around 4.55 p.m. Other locations in the path of the severe thunderstorm include Harvard and Clay Center. Remain alert for a possible tornado.
Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.30 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Adams and Clay. The sky was... National Weather Service in Aberdeen has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Western Hamlin County in northeastern South Dakota, southeastern Clark County in northeastern South Dakota, southwestern Coddington County in northeastern South Dakota, until 5.30 p.m. At 4.50 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Willow Lake, or 9 miles west of Bryant, moving northeast at 30 miles an hour. Hazard, 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Willow Lake and Mayfield Colony around 4.55 p.m. Bryant and Vienna around 5 p.m. Kellerton Church around 5.10 p.m. Other locations in the path of the Sofia thunderstorm include Hazel and Hamlin Education Center. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a Sofia thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.30 p.m. for the following counties in South Dakota, Clark and Hamlin. National Weather Service in Burlington has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Orange County in central Vermont, Southern Caledonia County in northeastern Vermont, East Central Addison County in central Vermont, North Central Windsor County in southern Vermont, South Central Washington County in central Vermont, until 6.45 p.m. At 5.49 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over East Braintree, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and penny size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, expects damage to trees and power lines. Locations impacted include Braintree Hill, Bradford, Chelsea, Corinth, Randolph, Topsham, Fairley, West Fairley, Tunbridge, Vershire, Corinth Corners, Topsham Four Corners, Washington, Wells River Village, Dewberry, Newberry Village, Roxbury, Williamstown, Braintree, and Brookfield. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. The National Weather Service in Raleigh has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Wake County, Southeastern Durham County, Northeastern Chatham County, until 6.45 p.m. At 5.56 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Cary to 6 miles northeast of Fuquay Varina, moving northeast at 10 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Raleigh, Durham, Cary, Garner, Fuquay Varina, RDU International, Apex, Holly Springs, Morrisville, and Nightdale. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.45 p.m. for the following counties in North Carolina, Chatham, Durham, and Wake.
The National Weather Service in Raleigh has issued a flash flood warning for East Central Chatham County, Southwestern Wake County, until 8 p.m. At 5.57 p.m., Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard, flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. Impact, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Raleigh, Cary, Garner, Fuquay Varina, Apex, Holly Springs, Morrisville, New Hill, Carpenter, Lake Wheeler, Harris Lake Boat Launch, Sharon Harris Reservoir and Jordan Lake. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Be aware of your surroundings and do not drive on flooded roads. Repeating, a flash flood warning has been issued until 8 p.m. for the following counties in North Carolina, Chatham and Wake. The National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Emmett County in northwestern Iowa, southwestern Cossuth County in north-central Iowa, eastern Palo Alto County in northwestern Iowa until 5.45 p.m. At 4.57 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Five Island Lake, or near Emmitsburg, moving east at 20 miles an hour. Hazard, 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Emmitsburg, Five Island Lake, Grittinger, West Bend, Whittemore, Fenton, Lone Rock, Cylinder, Rodman, Kearney State Park, Emmitsburg Municipal Airport, and Stinson Prairie State Park. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.45 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Emmett and Palo Alto. destructive storm. Expected hazards include 80 miles per hour wind gusts and ping pong ball size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be heavily damaged. Expect considerable damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles. Extensive tree damage and power outages are likely. Locations impacted include Ransom, Trago Center, Arnold, Utica, for your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in Kansas, Ness, and Trago. Hazards include tornado and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near Clay Center around 5.05 p.m. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 5.30 p.m. for the following county, Clay, Nebraska. The National Weather Service in Bismarck has issued a tornado warning for Central Montreal County in northwestern North Dakota until 5.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 5.08 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a confirmed tornado was located near Belden, or 10 miles south of Stanley, moving southeast at 10 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado. A tornado has been confirmed by trained weather spotters. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. 
Tree damage is likely. The tornado will be near Belden around 5.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. To repeat, a tornado is on the ground. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Service in Goodland has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Logan County, southwestern Gove County, until 5.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 5.13 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 7 miles northeast of Scott State Lake, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts and ping pong ball size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect considerable tree damage. Wind damage is also likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of southeastern Logan and southwestern Gove counties, including the following locations, the Monument Rocks. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Kansas, Gove and Logan. Severe thunderstorm warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Southern Clay County, Knuckles County, Southern Fillmore County, Sayre County, until 6 p.m. At 5.14 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 6 miles northwest of Ong to near Hardy, moving east at 40 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Davenport, Roskin, Oak, and all around 5.20 p.m. Deschler and Shickley around 5.25 p.m. Carlton and Byron around 5.30 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Strang, Hebron, Pruning, Chester, Belvedere, Ohio, Wall and Hubble. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Clay, Fillmore, Knuckles and Thayer. Severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Harnett County, south central Wake County, southwestern Johnston County, until 7 p.m. At 6.14 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 9 miles southwest of Angier to near Lillington to near Dunn, moving northeast at 15 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Lillington, Fuquay of Arena, Dunn, Angier, Benson, Irwin, Coates, Four Oaks, Raven Rock State Park, and Coates Crossroads. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7 p.m. for the following counties in North Carolina, Harnett, Johnston, and Wake.
at 4.17 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 10 miles west of Biddle to 11 miles south of Akita, moving southeast at 25 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts. Source, radar indicated. Impact, expects damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Foxkin Mine, Ikiva, and recluse around 4.25 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Gillette, Eagle Butte Mine, and Gillette Airport around 4.30 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Raw Height Mine, Dry Fork Mine, and Weston around 4.35 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Port High Point and Camplex Event Facility around 4.45 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Yodak Mine around 4.50 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. This includes Interstate 90 in Wyoming between mile markers 107 and 133. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 5.15 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time for the following county, Campbell, Wyoming. Severe thunderstorm watch number 509, effective until 12 a.m. Sunday. This watch includes the following counties in Nebraska, Cass, Gage, Johnson, Lancaster, Odo, Celine, and Seward. This watch includes the following counties in Nebraska, Cass, and Odo. This watch includes the following counties in Kansas, Atchison, Jackson, Potawatomi, and Riley. Remember, a severe thunderstorm watch means the conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including large hail and damaging winds, in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets, or internet sources for the latest severe weather information. Repeating, severe thunderstorm watch number 509 has been issued from 5.20 p.m. until midnight Sunday for the following counties, in Kansas, Atchison, Jackson, Potawatomi, and Riley. Chance of rain 20%. The National Weather Service in Amarillo has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Carson County, east central Potter County, until 6.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 5.22 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 16 miles northeast of Amarillo, moving east-southeast at 5 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source. Radar indicated. Impact, minor damage to roofs, siding, and trees is possible. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Locations impacted include, Pantex. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Texas, Carson and Potter. In northeastern South Dakota, until 6.15 p.m. At 5.24 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Bryant, moving east at 30 miles an hour. Hazard, 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, law enforcement. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. 
This of your thunderstorm will be near Lake Norton and Hamlin Education Center around 5.30 p.m. Hay High and Lake Albert around 5.35 p.m. Lake Points at around 5.40 p.m. Other locations in the path of this of your thunderstorm include Stonebridge and Castlewood. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.15 p.m. for the following county, Hanlon, South Dakota. Located near Clay Center, or 18 miles east of Hastings, moving east at 55 miles per hour. Expected hazards in... This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Sutton and Sarandville around 5.30 p.m. Grafton around 5.40 p.m. Fairmont around 5.45 p.m. Other locations in the path of a severe thunderstorm include Geneva and Exeter. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 06, 15 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Clay, Fillmore, and York. Western Humboldt County in north-central Iowa, southeastern Palo Alto County in northwestern Iowa, until 6.15 p.m. At 5.27 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over West Bend, or 12 miles southwest of Algona, moving southeast at 30 miles an hour. Hazard, ping-pong ball-size hail and 60 miles an hour wind gusts. Source, radar indicated. Impact, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Humboldt, West Bend, Whittemore, Livermore, Bode, Luverne, Rutland, Bradgate, St. Joseph, Ottoson, Rodman, Irvington, Stinson Prairie State Park, Aakal State Park, and Humboldt Municipal Airport. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.15 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa. Palo Alto and Pocahontas. Expected hazards include tornado and ping pong ball size hail. This is a radar indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near Geneva around 5.40 p.m. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 5.45 p.m. For the following counties, in Nebraska, Clay and Fillmore, The National Weather Service in Sioux Falls has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Kingsbury County and east central South Dakota, northwestern Brookings County and east central South Dakota, until 6.15 p.m. At 5.29 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Badger, or 8 miles southeast of Bryant, moving east at 30 miles an hour. Hazard, 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Badger around 5.35 p.m. Oakwood State Park around 5.45 p.m. 
for your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.15 p.m. for the following counties in South Dakota, Kingsbury, and Brookings. Service in Upton, New York has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Central Fairfield County, Southwestern New Haven County, until 7.15 p.m. At 6.30 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Reading, or 7 miles south of Newtown, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, minor hail damage to vehicles is possible. Expect wind damage to trees and power lines. Locations impacted include New Haven, Danbury, Milford, Shelton, Naugatuck, Southbury, Newtown, Fairfield, Stratford, Trumbull, Monroe, Bethel, Wilton, Seymour, and Orange. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Large hail, damaging wind, and continuous cloud-to-ground lightning are occurring with this storm. Move indoors immediately. Lightning is one of nature's leading killers. Remember, if you can hear thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. We're located along a line... The National Weather Service in Raleigh has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Southern Granville County, Northeastern Wake County, Southern Durham County, Southwestern Franklin County, until 7.15 p.m. At 6.31 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Durham to 7 miles west of Wake Forest to 7 miles east of Raleigh, moving northeast at 25 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour in gusts and nickel-sized hail. Source. Radar indicated. Impact, expect damage to roof, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Raleigh, Durham, Creed Moor, Wake Forest, Butner, Veblen, Franklinton, RDU International, Nightdale, and Wendell. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.15 p.m. for the following counties in North Carolina, Durham, Franklin, Granville, and Wake. Weather Service in Dodge City has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Scott County in West Central Kansas, Ness County in West Central Kansas, Southern Trago County in West Central Kansas, Lane County in West Central Kansas, until 6.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 5.33 p.m. Central Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Scott State Lake to 6 miles north of Peeler, moving southeast at 40 miles per hour. These are destructive storms. Expected hazards include 80 miles per hour wind gusts and golf ball size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be heavily damaged. Expect considerable damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles. Extensive tree damage and power outages are likely. Severe thunderstorms will be near Dighton, Alamoda, Manning, and Beeler around 5.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Gridston and Amy around 5.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Large hail, damaging wind, and continuous cloud-to-ground lightning are occurring with these storms. Move indoors immediately. Lightning is one of nature's leading killers. Remember, if you can hear thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. 
Torrential rainfall is occurring with these storms and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in Kansas, Ness, and Trago. Thunderstorm Watch Number 510, effective until midnight Sunday. This watch includes the following counties, Pawnee and Stafford. Remember, a severe thunderstorm watch means that conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including large hail and damaging winds, both in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets, or Internet sources for the latest severe weather information. This is a test. The emergency alert system. This is only a test. Flooding. The National Weather Service in Raleigh has issued a flash flood warning for Southern Durham County, Central Wake County, until 8.45 p.m. At 6.40 p.m., Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the Warren area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard, flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. Impact, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Raleigh, Durham, Cary, Wake Forest, RDU International, Morrisville, Nightdale, Roseville, Falls Lake Boat Ramp, William B. Umstead State Park, Raleigh View Marina, Falls Lake State Rec Area, Falls Lake, Research Triangle, Bethesda, Gorman, Parkwood and Jordan Lake. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Be aware of your surroundings and do not drive on flooded roads. Repeating, a flash flood warning has been issued until 8.45 p.m. for the following counties in North Carolina, Durham and Wake. Tornado warning information. The National Weather Service in Hastings has issued a tornado warning for Central Fillmore County until 6.15 p.m. At 5.43 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located near Geneva, or 22 miles south of York, moving east at 40 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and ping-pong ball size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near Geneva around 5.50 p.m. Milligan around 6 p.m. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 06.15 p.m. for the following county, Fillmore, Nebraska.
National Weather Service in Omaha has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Jefferson County in southeastern Nebraska, southwestern Seward County in southeastern Nebraska, Saline County in southeastern Nebraska, until 6.45 p.m. At 5.49 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 3 miles southeast of Weston to 2 miles north of Bruning to 3 miles west of Chester, moving east at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include ping-pong ball-size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. Impact, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Fairbury, Milford, Friend, Dorchester, Western, Dickin, Cordova, and a cut, Jansen, Tobias, Swanson, Reynolds, Swan Creek Reservoir No. 2, the Highway 41 and 15 South Junction, Swan Creek Wildlife Management Area, Alexandria State Recreation Area, Blue River State Recreation Area, Crystal Springs Campground, Buckley Creek Recreational Area, and Camp Jefferson. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. For County, Eastern Fayette County, until 6.30 p.m. At 5.59 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Milligan to near Gilead, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Damage is likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. Severe thunderstorms will be near Alexandria and Gilead around 6.05 p.m. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.30 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Fillmore and Fair. The National Weather Service in Omaha has issued a tornado warning for Central Saline County in southeastern Nebraska until 6.30 p.m. At 6.02 p.m., a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located 4 miles south of Exeter, or 22 miles south of York, moving east at 40 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and ping-pong ball-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat rotation. Impact, flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near, friend around 6.10 p.m. Other locations in the path of this tornadic thunderstorm include Dorchester. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, Move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 6.30 p.m. for the following county, Saline, Nebraska. One was located over Arlington, or 13 miles south of Lake Poinsett, moving east at 30 miles an hour. Hazard, 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Volga and Bruce around 6.10 p.m. Brookings around 6.15 p.m. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 6.45 p.m. for the following counties in South Dakota, Kingsbury, and Brookings. Hazard.
The National Weather Service in Amarillo has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Carson County, southeastern Potter County, until 7.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 6.11 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 12 miles northwest of Washburn, or 12 miles northeast of Amarillo, moving southeast at 5 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, minor damage to roofs, siding, and trees is possible. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Locations impacted include, Pantex. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Texas, Carson and Potter. Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Webster County in central Iowa, southwestern Wright County in north central Iowa, Humboldt County in north central Iowa, until 7 p.m. At 6.10 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Humboldt Municipal Airport, or near Dakota City, moving southeast at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include, Fort Dodge, Dakota City, Humboldt, Eagle Grove, Fort Dodge Regional Airport, Goldfield, Badger, Livermore, Thor, Vincent, Rutland, Hardy, Frank A. Dodge State Park, Eagle Grove Municipal Airport, Sportsman Park, and Humboldt Municipal Airport. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7 p.m. for the following counties, in Iowa, Humboldt, Webster and Wright. issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Finney County in southwestern Kansas, southeastern Scott County in west central Kansas, Hodgman County in southwestern Kansas, western Pawnee County, western Rush County, northwestern Edwards County, until 7.15 p.m. At 6.14 p.m., severe thunderstorms extended from near Bazin to 10 miles south of Beeler to 6 miles east of shallow water, moving southeast at 40 miles per hour. You can expect 60 mile per hour in gusts and quarter size hail. The warning was based on radar indications. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Jetmore, Gray, Verded, Hanston, and Calvista. Weather Service in Omaha has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southern Lancaster County in southeastern Nebraska, northeastern Jefferson County in southeastern Nebraska, southeastern Seward County in southeastern Nebraska, eastern Saline County in southeastern Nebraska, Gage County in southeastern Nebraska, until 7.30 p.m. At 6.23 p.m., 
severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from four miles northwest of Dorchester to four miles west of Wilbert and two miles northwest of Jensen, moving east at 50 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Lincoln, Beatrice, Crete, Wilbur, Hickman, Bennett, Firth, Adams, DeWitt, Cortland, Plymouth, Panama, Claytonia, Roca, Hallam, Pleasantdale, Pickrill, Sprague, Philly, and Virginia. This includes Interstate 80 in Nebraska near mile marker 397. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.30 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Gage, Jefferson, Lancaster, Celine, and Seward. The following impacts are expected, expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near, Ness City, Bazine, Alamoda, and Beeler around 6.35 p.m. Central Daylight Time. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Ness, Kansas. Mecklenburg has issued a flash flood warning for southeastern Mecklenburg County in the Piedmont of North Carolina until 10.45 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 7.41 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Doppler radar and automated rain gauges indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Between 2 and 4 inches of rain have fallen. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard, flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar and automated gauges. Impact, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Charlotte, Matthews, Mid Hill, Pineville, South Park Mall, The Plaza, The Arboretum, Freedom Park and Ditton Valley. Flooding of Addison Drive is likely inundated by 2 to 4 inches of flood waters as McMullen Creek exceeds its banks up and downstream of the Addison Drive culverts, flooding adjacent low-lying areas. When it is safe to do so, please report flooding or threatening roads or property to the National Weather Service Greenville Spartanburg by calling toll-free 1-800-267-8101 by posting on our Facebook page or via Twitter using hashtag NWSGSP. Your message should describe the specific location where impacts occurred and the depth of flooding observed. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Be aware of your surroundings and do not drive on flooded roads. The National Weather Service in Amarillo has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Armstrong County northeastern Randall County, until 7.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 6.41 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 7 miles northeast of Palo Duro Canyon, or 14 miles west of Claude, moving east at 15 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, minor damage to roofs siding, and trees is possible. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Locations impacted include Claude, Washburn, and Palo Duro Canyon. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in Texas, Armstrong and Randall. At 7.41 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Between 0.5 and 2 inches of rain have fallen. Additional rainfall amounts of 1 to 3 inches are possible in the warned area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. 
The following hazards are expected. Flash flooding caused by thunderstorm. The National Weather Service in the Twin Cities has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for North Central Chippewa County, Central Swift County, until 7.15 p.m. At 6.27 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located 9 miles northeast of Milan, or 16 miles north of Montevideo, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter side hail. This is a radar indicator. Threat. The following Center, impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. This includes Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Benson, Hagen, Delaware Graph, and Big Bend City. This includes U.S. It's Highway. Not it's not, it's not, 12 not between amazing. mile markers 39 and 49. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.15 p.m. for the following counties, in Minnesota, Chippewa, and Swift. in Central Iowa, Southwestern Franklin County in North Central Iowa, Southern Wright County in North Central Iowa, Southeastern Humboldt County in North Central Iowa, Northern Hamilton County in Central Iowa, until 7.30 p.m. At 6.45 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Eagle Grove Municipal Airport, or 10 miles west of Clarion, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Webster City, Clarion, Eagle Grove, Big Wall Lake, Goldfield, Dows, Blairsburg, Camrar, Thor, Vincent, Wolstock, Pope Joy, Galt, Clarion Municipal Airport, Eagle Grove Municipal Airport, and Sportsman Park. This includes Interstate 35 between mile markers 147 and 158. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.30 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Franklin, Hamilton, Humboldt, Webster, and Wright. Only has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Warren County, northeastern Nash County, northwestern Edgecombe County, southwestern Halifax County, east central Franklin County, until 8.45 p.m. At 8 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 11 miles northwest of Dorchester near Nashville, moving northeast at 25 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and nickel size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, expects damage to roofs siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Rocky Mount, Nashville, Dorches, Red Oak, Enfield, Whitakers, Castalia, Glenview, Arcola, and Battleboro. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.45 p.m. for the following counties in North Carolina, Edgecombe, Franklin, Halifax, Nash, and Warren. to a storm surge warning and a tropical storm warning remains in effect for the following counties in Texas, Bolivar Peninsula, Chambers, Galveston Island and Inland Galveston.
following messages for the following counties in South Carolina, Dillon and Florence. The National Weather Service in Wilmington has issued a flash flood warning for southeastern Darlington County in northeastern South Carolina, west central Dillon County in northeastern South Carolina, northwestern Florence County in northeastern South Carolina, southeastern Marlboro County in northeastern South Carolina until 10.30 p.m. At 8.03 p.m., Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the Warren area. Between 1.5 and 3 inches of rain have fallen. Additional rainfall amounts of 1 to 2 inches are possible in the Warren area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard, flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. Impact, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Florence, Darlington, Timmonsville, Quimby, Florence Darlington Technical College Main Campus, Mechanicsville, Brownsville, Effingham, Bingham, Blenheim, McLeod Regional Medical Center, Health South Rehabilitation Hospital, Carolina's Hospital System, Cedar Tower and Carolina's Hospital System. Dangerous flooding from heavy rainfall can be expected, especially near poor drainage areas and other flood-prone locations. It is harder to recognize flood dangers at night, as it will be difficult to determine the depth of the water. Roads may be damaged or washed away. Most of flood deaths occur in vehicles. If flooding is observed, then turn around, don't drown. Excessive runoff from heavy rainfall will cause dangerous flooding, especially near creeks and streams, drainage ditches, and low-lying flood-prone areas. Turn around, don't drown if you encounter a flooded road. a flash flood warning for northeastern Lawrence County in central Georgia, southeastern Wilkinson County in central Georgia, central Johnson County in east central Georgia, northwestern Trutland County in east central Georgia, south central Washington County in east central Georgia, until 2 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 8.04 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Between 2.5 and 3.5 inches of rain have fallen. Additional rainfall amounts up to 1 inch are possible in the Warren area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard, flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar indicated. Impact, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Dublin, Wrightsville, East Dublin, Adrian, Dexter, Rents, Bruton, Minter, Lovett, Span, Scott, Tucker's Crossroad, Rock Ledge, Harlow, Orlin, Oriana, Lowry, and Blackville. Turn around, do not drown when encountering flooded roads. Most of flood deaths occur in vehicles. thunderstorm warning for Johnson County in southeastern Nebraska, western Nemaha County in southeastern Nebraska, Odo County in southeastern Nebraska, northwestern Pawnee County in southeastern Nebraska, southwestern Cass County in southeastern Nebraska, until 8 p.m. At 7.06 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from Lincoln to 3 miles north of Adams to 3 miles east of Holmesville, moving east at 40 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. Impact expects damage to roofs, siding, and trees. 
Locations impacted include Tecumseh, Syracuse, Weeping Water, Eagle, Elmwood, Palmyra, Sterling, Johnson, Cook, Unadilla, Avica, Talmadge, Mihaka, Dunbar, Douglas, Brock, Elk Creek, Lewiston, Lorton, and Crab Orchard. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8 p.m. for the following counties in Nebraska, Cass, Johnson, Nemaha, Odo, and Pawnee. Service in North Platte has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Cherry County in north central Nebraska, northeastern Grant County in west central Nebraska, northwestern Hooker County in west central Nebraska until 7 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. At 6.11 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 16 miles northwest of Whitman or 36 miles northwest of Mullen, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Whitman, Whitman Road crossing the north branch of the Middle Loop River, Duluth, Weir, and Higher. This includes the following highways, Highway 2 between mile markers 150 and 169, Highway 61 between mile markers 165 and 182. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Cherry, Nebraska. Mountain Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Powley, or 7 miles west of Holyoke, moving southeast at 35 miles an hour. Hazard, quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, damage to vehicles is expected. Food, Holyoke, Powley, Amherst, and Pleasant Valley. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. until 11.30 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 8.20 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Between 1 and 2.5 inches of rain have fallen. Additional rainfall amounts of 1 to 3 inches are possible in the warned area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. The following hazards are expected. Flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. The following impacts are expected, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include North Augusta, Waynesboro, Fort Eisenhower, Augusta, Hethzibah, McBean, 
South Augusta, Augusta Regional Airport, Glendale, Augusta Mall, Daniel Field, Midtown, Somerville, Golf, Blythe, Keysville, Elwood, Diamond Lakes Regional Park, Peepatch Aerodrome and Miles Park. This includes the following highways, Interstate 520 in South Carolina between mile marker 16 and 17, Interstate 520 in Georgia between mile markers 2 and 15. Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for North Central Story County in Central Iowa, Southwestern Hardin County in Central Iowa, South Central Wright County in North Central Iowa, Eastern Hamilton County in Central Iowa, until 8.15 p.m. At 7.27 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Blairsburg, or six miles east of Webster City, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include golf ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. Severe weather has been confirmed by train spotters reported ping pong ball sized hail in Eagle Grove. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Webster City, Roland, Jewel Junction, Hubbard, Radcliffe, Ellsworth, Williams, Blairsburg, Camrar, Randall, Buckeye, Garden City, and Drake Airport. This includes Interstate 35 between mile markers 127 and 149. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.15 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Hamilton, Harding, Story and Wright. The National Weather Service in Amarillo has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Southern Armstrong County until 8.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 7.28 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 10 miles east of Palo Duro Canyon, or 11 miles southwest of Claude moving southeast at 15 miles per hour. Hazard, golf ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. Source, radar indicated. Impact, minor damage to roofs, siding, and trees is possible. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of southern Armstrong County. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Armstrong, Texas. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Pawnee County, southwestern Rush County, until 8.15 p.m. At 7.29 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located 8 miles south of Nakoma, moving southeast at 25 miles per hour. You can expect quarter-size hail. The warning was based on radar indications. The following impacts are expected. Damage to vehicles is expected. Locations impacted include Esh Valley. The National Weather Service in Greenville, Spartanburg has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Davie County, northeastern Iredell County, until 9.15 p.m. At 8.33 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located 12 miles southwest of Yadkinville, or near Harmony, moving northeast at 15 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, minor hail damage to vehicles is expected. 
Expect wind damage to trees and power lines. Locations impacted include Harmony, Sheffield, Farmington, Turnersburg, Olin, and Union Grove. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Large hail, damaging wind, and continuous cloud-to-ground lightning are occurring with this storm. Move indoors immediately. Lightning is one of nature's leading killers. Remember, if you can hear thunder, you are close enough to be struck by lightning. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Please report damaging winds, hail, or flooding to the National Weather Service by calling toll-free 1-800-267-8101 or by posting on our Facebook page or tweet at using hashtag NWSGSP. Your message should describe the event and the specific location where it occurred. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 9.15 p.m. for the following counties in North Carolina, Davie and Iredell. Service in Sioux Falls has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Rock County in southwestern Minnesota, northwestern Nobles County in southwestern Minnesota, southeastern Pipestone County in southwestern Minnesota, western Murray County in southwestern Minnesota, until 8.15 p.m. At 7.33 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Chandler, or 14 miles southeast of Pipestone, moving northeast at 30 miles an hour. Hazard 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Chandler, Lake Wilson, and Woodstock around 7.40 p.m. Slayton around 7.50 p.m. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.15 p.m. for the following counties, in Minnesota, Nobles, Pipestone, Rock and Murray. issued a severe thunderstorm warning for North Central Finney County in southwestern Kansas, southeastern Scott County in west central Kansas, southern Lane County in west central Kansas, until 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 7.36 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 9 miles south of Amy, moving southeast at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include ping pong ball size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of north central Finney, southeastern Scott and southern Lane counties. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Finney, Kansas. Service in Goodland has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Yuma County in northeastern Colorado, northern Cheyenne County in northwestern Kansas, Dundee County in southwestern Nebraska, until 7.30 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time, or 8.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 6.36 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time, or 7.36 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 8 miles southwest of Pleasant Valley, Oregon, 10 miles southeast of Holyoke, moving southeast at 60 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half-dollar-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. 
The following impacts are expected. Hill damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Bangleman around 7.20 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Other locations impacted by the severe thunderstorm include Laird, Parks, Max, Alvin, and Juanita. This includes Highway 385 between mile markers 238 and 270. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time or 7.30 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time for the following county, Cheyenne, Kansas, and Yuma, Colorado, and Dundee, Nebraska. The National Weather Service in Sioux Falls has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Northwestern Rock County in southwestern Minnesota, Pinestone County in southwestern Minnesota, West Central Murray County in southwestern Minnesota, southeastern Moody County in east central South Dakota, until 8.30 p.m. At 7.46 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Pinestone, moving northeast at 30 miles an hour. Hazard 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Pipestone, Trosky, and Pipestone National Monument around 7.50 p.m. Holland around 7.55 p.m. Woodstock around 8 p.m. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.30 p.m. for the following counties in Minnesota, Pinestone, Rock and Murray, and Moody, South Dakota. Missing Amarillo has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Western Randall County until 9 p.m. Central Daylight Time. The New Hampshire at 7.55 p.m. Central Daylight Time, demo. a severe thunderstorm was this located of the New over Hampshire a marker Alert or 10 system. miles west of Canyon, moving east at 10 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, minor damage to roofs, siding, and trees is possible. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Locations impacted include Canyon Park and Buffalo Lake. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 9 p.m. Cent. Randall, Texas. And Pines. The National Weather Service in Sioux Falls has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Lyon County in southwestern Minnesota, northeastern Murray County in southwestern Minnesota, until 8.45 p.m. At 8.01 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Lake Sheetek State Park, or near Slayton, moving northeast at 35 miles an hour. Hazard, 60 miles an hour wind gusts and quarter size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will be near Curry and Lake Sheetek State Park around 8.05 p.m. Tracy around 8.10 p.m. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 8.45 p.m. for the following counties in Minnesota, Murray and Lyon. National 
Weather Service in Dodge City has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Ford County in southwestern Kansas, northern Kiowa County in south-central Kansas, northern Meade County in southwestern Kansas, Gray County in southwestern Kansas, Edwards County in south-central Kansas, northwestern Clark County in southwestern Kansas, until 9.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 8.07 p.m. Central Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from 7 miles south of Burdette to near Ensign, moving southeast at 40 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and penny-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Dodge City, Spearville, Overly, Wright, Fort Dodge, and Belfont around 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Kinsley around 8.20 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Lewis and Windhorst around 8.25 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Fort, Bloom, Centerview, Buckland, Kingstown, Salzburg, Mullinville, Truesdale, and Greensburg. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 9.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Kansas, Clark, Ford, Gray, and the Meade. The National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for North Central Story County in Central Iowa, Southwestern Hardin County in Central Iowa, Hamilton County in Central Iowa, until 9 p.m. At 8.12 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Webster City, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Webster City, Story City, Roland, Jewel Junction, Radcliffe, Ellsworth, Blairsburg, Camrar, Randall, Buckeye, Garden City, Webster City Municipal Airport, and Drake Airport. This includes Interstate 35 between mile markers 121 and 144. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 9 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Hamilton, Hardin and Story. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Pawnee County, Western Stafford County, Southeastern Rush County, Northeastern Edwards County, until 9 p.m. At 8.15 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located near Larned, moving southeast at 35 miles per hour. You can expect 60 mile per hour wind gusts and penny-size hail. The warning was based on radar indications. The following impacts are expected. Expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Dillon and St. John. The flood advisory is replaced by a flash flood warning for a portion of central North Carolina, including the following area, Guilford. The threat of flooding continues and a flash flood warning is now in effect. Please refer to the bulletin for more information. Weather Service in Raleigh has issued a flash flood warning for West Central Guilford County until 12.30 a.m. At 9.27 p.m., Doppler radar and automated rain gauges indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Up to one and one-half inches of rain have fallen. Additional rainfall amounts up to two inches are possible in the warned area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. 
Hazard, flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar and automated gauges. Impact, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Greensboro, High Point and Colfax. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Be especially cautious at night when it is harder to recognize the dangers of flooding. Repeating, a flash flood warning has been issued until 12.30 a.m. Sunday for the following county, Guilford, North Carolina. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Kiowa County, Meade County in southwestern Kansas, northwestern Barber County, northern Comanche County, southern Stafford County, Platt County, Clark County in southwestern Kansas, until 9.45 p.m. At 8.38 p.m., severe thunderstorms extended from near Maxville to 8 miles northwest of Bloom, moving southeast at 45 miles per hour. You can expect 60 mile per hour wind gusts. The warning was based on radar indications. The following impacts are expected, expects damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Mullenville, Byers, and Hopewell around 8.45 p.m. Greensburg around 8.50 p.m. Haverland, Collison, Clark State Lake, and Wellsford around 8.55 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Pratt, Coates, Belvedere, Croft, Ashland, Sawyer, Wilmore, Coldwater, Protection, Sitka, Sun City and Lake Coldwater. <coughs> Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of central Finney and northwestern Gray Counties. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 9.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in Kansas, Finney and Gray. Service in Dodge City has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Ford County in southwestern Kansas, eastern Finney County in southwestern Kansas, western Hodgman County in southwestern Kansas, Gray County in southwestern Kansas, until 10.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 9.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 8 miles north of Charleston, moving east at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Wind damage is also likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of northwestern Ford, eastern Finney, western Hodgman and Gray Counties. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 10.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in Kansas, Finney, Ford, Gray and Hodgman. The 
National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Story County in central Iowa, southeastern Hardin County in central Iowa, western Marshall County in central Iowa, until 10.15 p.m. At 9.29 p.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Zering, or 14 miles northeast of Nevada, moving southeast at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include State Center, Veering, Albion, McCallsburg, Liscombe, Clemens, St. Anthony, and Marshalltown Municipal Airport. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 10.15 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Hardin, Marshall, and Story. County in southwestern Kansas until 10.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 9.33 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located near Charleston, moving east at 30 miles per hour. Expected hazards include tornado and golf ball size hail. This is a radar indicated threat rotation. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near Ingalls around 9.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Summer on around 9.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home, or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Repeating, a tornado warning has been issued until 10.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Gray, Kansas. P.m. Central Daylight Time. At 9.43 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near shallow water, moving southeast at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include ping-pong ball-size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. People and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. This severe thunderstorm will remain over mainly rural areas of north-central Finney, southeastern Scott, and southwestern Lane counties. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 10.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following county, Finney, Kansas. Service in North Platte has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northeastern Arthur County in west central Nebraska, southern Grant County in west central Nebraska, southwestern Hooker County in west central Nebraska, northwestern McPherson County in west central Nebraska, until 10.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time or 9.30 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. At 9.49 p.m. Central Daylight Time, or 8.49 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Whitman to 6 miles south of Hyannis to 8 miles south of Ashby, moving southeast at 25 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. Impact, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Swan Lake, Jensen Lake, Green Lake, Sand Beach Lake, Lena, Sandpudding Lake, 
Sweet Lake, Pratt Lake, Spring Valley Lake, Cogill Lake, and East Cody Lake. This includes Highway 61 between mile markers 130 and 153. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 9.30 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time or 10.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties in Nebraska, Arthur and McPherson. Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Pawnee County, Rush County, until 10.45 p.m. At 9.57 p.m., severe thunderstorms extended from near Schaefer to near Burdett, moving north at 35 miles per hour. You can expect 60 mile per hour wind gusts. Source, MesoNet indicated. The following impacts are expected, expects damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Severe thunderstorms will be near Otis, Timken, and Schaefer around 10.05 p.m. Bison and Rush Center around 10.10 p.m. La Crosse around 10.15 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Nakoma, Alexander, Hargrave, Loretta, and Liebenthal. At 10.10 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near the Haggard Elevator, moving southeast at 30 miles per hour. This is a destructive storm. Expected hazards include 80 miles per hour wind gusts and nickel size hail. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be heavily damaged. Expect considerable damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles. Extensive tree damage and power outages are likely. This severe thunderstorm will be near Ensign and the Haggard Elevator around 10.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Remain alert for a possible tornado. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. If you spot a tornado, go at once into the basement or small central room in a sturdy structure. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 11.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time for the following counties, in Kansas, Clark, Ford, Gray, and Meade. For the following counties, Sunny and Hodgman. The National Weather Service in Dodge City has issued a flash flood warning for northeastern Finney County in southwestern Kansas, northwestern Hodgman County in southwestern Kansas, southern Lane County in west central Kansas, southwestern Ness County in west central Kansas, southeastern Scott County in west central Kansas, until 2.30 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 10.25 p.m. Central Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Between 1 and 3 inches of rain have fallen. The expected rainfall rate is 1 to 2 inches in 3 hours. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Expected hazards include flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. The following impacts are expected. Flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Calvesta and shallow water. Be especially cautious at night when it is harder to recognize the dangers of flooding. The civil authorities have issued a required weekly test for all of Kentucky. Davies is KY, Fayette KY, Franklin KY, Madison KY, and Ohio KY, beginning at 9.48 a.m. and ending at 10.03 a.m. This is a test of the emergency alert system. This is only a test. No action is needed.
This is only a test. Southwestern Kansas, Northwestern Finney County in southwestern Kansas, Southern Scott County in west central Kansas, until midnight central daylight time. At 10.53 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 8 miles south of Modoc, moving southeast at 15 miles per hour. Expected hazards include ping-pong ball-size hail and 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, people and animals outdoors will be injured. Expect hail damage to roofs, siding, windows, and vehicles. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include, friend, for your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until midnight central daylight time Sunday for the following county, Finney, Kansas. Service in Dodge City has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Meade County in southwestern Kansas, Western Clark County in southwestern Kansas, until 12.15 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 11.07 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located 7 miles southeast of Fowler, moving southeast at 20 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. This is a radar-indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include, Ashland. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 12.15 a.m. Central Daylight Time Sunday for the following counties, in Kansas, Clark and Meade. County in southwestern Maine, southwestern Lincoln County in south central Maine, northeastern Cumberland County in southwestern Maine, central Sagadahawk County in south central Maine, until 1.15 a.m. At 12.29 a.m., a severe thunderstorm was located over Topsom, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Hazard, 60 miles per hour wind gusts and quarter-size hail. Source, radar indicated. Impact. Hail damage to vehicles is expected. Expect wind damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Brunswick, Bath, Damariscotta, Topsum, Wiscasset, Bristol, Woolwich, Lisbon, Durham, Booth Bay, Bowdoin, Bowdenham, Jefferson, Dresden, Edgecombe, Alna, Arosic, Newcastle, Westport, and South Bristol. This includes Interstate 295 between mile markers 29 and 42. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 1.15 a.m. for the following counties in Maine, Androscoggin, Cumberland, Lincoln and Sagadahawk. to 2 inches in 3 hours. Flash flooding is already occurring. 
Expected hazards include flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. The following impacts are expected, flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include, Cimarron, Ingalls and Charleston. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles, 